let's see, Richard from Oakland, California. Dennis, help. I'll be in Europe in a couple weeks, proudly wearing my DMZ, fight the power. They don't like Bush over there, and they love Obama. I share your views about him. When asked how I explain, how do I explain in brief, simple terms, why I won't be voting for him? Um, you know, I wouldn't bring it up. I'll tell you, it's a no-win over there. The people, you, I was just over in Europe for a while, and the people are nice there. It's not rancorous, but you cannot win a fight there. I just saw polling data today that said that if France voted for the presidency, 80% of the people would vote for, uh, for Barack Obama. But see, this is what they do. They project. It, it, it's always like one step removed. They can afford to do that with Barack Obama. They're freed up four out of five of them because they, he, they can't vote for him, and he's not running for them. But when it came down, push to shove, who did they pick in this last election? They picked the guy who immediately re-embraced America and is, you know, uh, much more to the right than Barack Obama would be perceived over there. Sarkozy is a guy who at some point called the people flipping Peugeots out in the suburbs because they didn't like edicts about having to take your veil off for a driver's license photo. He, re he viewed them to be punks, and he said it. And he said America's a great country and a great friend. So they had their chance to vote for whoever their Barack Obama was. I forget the gal's name. They didn't because they knew it was going to catch up to them. You can only go liberal so long before an adult has to sit down at the table and, uh, you know, get the kids' table together again. And it's fine to have the kids' table once in a while, historically, I guess. It's always going to be. It's a palate cleanser. But occasionally, you've got to have the grown-up come in and get things straight, and that's where they're at with Sarkozy now. So if I was over there, I wouldn't even, you know what, you go to Europe to get away from it. Have some Bernays, hang out, see some sights, enjoy the leisurely pace. And don't go anywhere near politics when over, over there because you can't win. Enjoy these samples of the bathroom sessions, a weekly video available only to members of the DMZ, the Dennis Miller Zone on DennisMillerRadio.com.